Four of the saddest moments in the history of Running Man Despite the fact that SBS's Running Man is generally recognized for its humor, there have been numerous instances that have left both the audience and the performers in tears. Here is a list of some of Running Man's most depressing moments in the show's history. 1. The final episode of Song Jung Ki Song Jung Ki was one of the original cast members of Running Man when it first premiered in 2010. Due to their similar ages, he eventually developed strong relationships with all of the members, especially Lee Kwang Soo. Song Joong Ki made the decision to leave Running Man about a year after joining the cast in order to concentrate on his acting career. Song Joong Ki was seen sobbing as he thanked the cast in his final episode. When Song Joong Ki left, Lee Kwang Soo and Song Ji Hyo became tearful, breaking viewers' hearts. 2. Lee Kwang Soo and Song Ji Hyo's Talk even though Lee Kwang Soo and Song Ji Hyo frequently argue, they genuinely care for one another. In a serious chat they once had, Song Ji Hyo expressed her gratitude to Lee Kwang Soo for supporting her while she was competing in Running Man. Song Ji Hyo struggled to connect with the other cast members when she initially started on the show. She shed many tears at this time and even thought about leaving the show. But when Lee Kwang Soo learned about it, he gave Song Ji Hyo some words of encouragement, for which she was grateful. Song Ji Hyo sobbed uncontrollably as she thanked Lee Kwang Soo for his thoughtful actions. 3. Running Man Nearly Getting Cancelled It was suddenly revealed that Running Man would be discontinued in late 2016. Both the cast members and show fans found this to be devastating news. Lee Kwang Soo's performance in Running Man led to his winning the Top Excellence Award at the 2016 SBS Entertainment Awards. He made an emotional remark during his acceptance speech for the honor. I'm sorry. I would like to thank the producers for working so hard to protect Running Man and maintain all the love it receives. I want to thank Ji Suk Jin for teaching me comedy and giving me life lessons. I want to thank Hezek who has made it possible for me to be here and my mentor John Cook. Haha is like my family, and Ji Hyo my real older sister, Gary my brother, and Jung Ki. I love you all. I've been so happy. I was happy for 7 years from when I was 28 to 33 now, and I thank you for giving me such a great award and love. This is more than I deserve. I will try my best to bring you laughter until the very end. Let's end everything on a good note. Thankfully, the show was not cancelled, which was wonderful news for both the cast members and the viewers. SBS stated, Running Man will still air even with all the cast members present. SBS and the six members have chosen to continue the Running Man series in response to the immense sadness felt by both Korean and international fans upon the conclusion of the show. The chief of headquarters of SBS, Nam Sung Young, who produced the program Running Man in 2010 has been meeting with the cast to conduct in-depth discussions about Running Man since the beginning of the year until recently. He repeatedly apologized to the audience members during these chats for the incidents that occurred during the show's reformatting. Following these negotiations, the six members decided to remain on the show. 4. Gary's Last Episode In 2010, Gary, a member of the Running Man original cast, joined the program. He ultimately developed strong relationships with all the members, especially Song Ji Hyo, who earned the moniker Monday Couple for their on-screen chemistry. Gary eventually left the program in 2016. The cast members did their best to be upbeat in his final episode, but by the time the credits rolled, they were overcome with grief. Since he left, Gary has committed himself to being a loving husband and parent.